Hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. Welcome back for more La Mulana 2. In the last episode, we derped around a bit, uh, found a crystal skull in the ancient chaos, um, but not much progress was made otherwise. However, uh, here in the Eternal Prison, I went to the, uh, I went through the gate at the bottom of that lava pool, and I found my way here. Eternal Prison Gloom. Um, let's, now, figure out what the deal is. Eurydice was turned to stone for breaking the code of the underworld. The last thing she hears is a song close to her part. Song of Paradise, played by her husband. That's, uh... Let's see, so... Okay, so, play a song on the harp for Eurydice. The Song of Paradise. I can do that. Uh, what is all this? Seems pretty dangerous. So yeah, uh, going through that one gate cost me my uh, gauntlets, but hopefully that is not a problem. I do want to be careful though, because I'm not quite sure how to get out of here. Oop, hello. Who is here? Fairy Guild Corporal. 400 gold? Okay. Key Fairy. We finally found her. The Key Fairy Herja. A secret finding Key Fairy. Alright, let's get out of here. That looks kind of dangerous, actually. Let's be careful about... Oops! Let's be careful about stupid stuff like that. Yes, thank you, video game. I'm trying not to get killed here. use sub weapons where we can uh, handle it. The last gate to hell who has endured several eras. The gate's decoration was done by hell's hand. An unadorned gate is a gate to hell. The first gate will take something from your person. I'm not quite sure what that means. Just yet. What is over on this side? This is uh, also eternal prison gloom. Oh, hi. I want those coins. Alright, what is through here? A way out! Alright. 
We rescued the key fairy. There's a, there are a couple of places I want to use her um, as soon as we summon her again. Also, since we have four fairies, let's go talk to Freya. Maybe she uh, has something to tell us. Because according to that one tablet in the Divine Fortress, the power of the four fairies will summon a block. Or something like that. Do you have something to say? You have nothing to say. Alright then. <clears throat> Alright, back to what we were doing. I want to go to Shrine of the Frost Giants because that's the uh, easiest fairy I know how to get to. None of the summoning spots appearing. Uh, let's see. Maybe something happened because I left with the key fairy trying to follow me. Let's save the game. Let's uh, return to the title screen. And let's reload. See if that fixes our problem. Indeed. Now. Oops. No, I don't want a healing fairy. Don't want a healing fairy. Don't want that. The Luck Fairy is nice, but not what we want. Yeah, here we go. And let's return to Takamagahara Shrine. Thank you, Miss Fairy. Let's open it up with our life seal and see what we have won for ourselves. Oops. The ring. Equip it to boost dexterity, improving weapon throwing technique. Alright. Let's see. I wonder where else we might be able to bring her. Uh, 
And we could just return to the, uh, to the Eternal Prison now, but... Oh, actually, there is a place I want to bring her. She's probably not going to show up for a little while. Um... <laughs> that was weird. make of it. Yay, state manipulations! Alright, let's go. It's two to the left of here. Bats are kind of in the way. I mean, not that they can hurt me since I have the uh, scriptures, but still. Oh. Yeah, right down there. I wish I had something that would let me summon any fairy I wanted. There we go. Alright, let's get down to where does he down? happening here. Anything? Seems like I'm missing something. 
Alright, where else can I take you? Sure. Oh! Something here? What's this? Sekhmet to fly now. Why did I do that? That was dumb. Alright, the fairy has led us to some data, I guess. Still don't know what the deal is here. But maybe we'll find out uh, by going someplace else. Like, for example, back to the Eternal Prison. We might as well. <laughs> Although, maybe I should have healed myself beforehand. Oh, well. Down we go. So yeah, the thing with this uh, with this gate is uh, that P-looking icon. Yeah, that is that appears to be Sigrun's gate. So I'm not really sure why going here takes us to a new area instead of out of the uh, out of the world entirely oh well Let's look around a bit oh. the rudest enemy these things have way too much HP Alright, what is through here? Brahma asked Abzu, what is creation? Abzu was begotten of pure waters, so he'd answered that undefiled clear waters are creation. So good. Yeah. Alright, what are you? He's a Nami. Among the gates to hell lies a fake gate. Past the gates, there's a deep valley called Blick John the Bowl. That's where Sigrid's gate is, but I've heard stories that suggest otherwise. That past the fake gate there lived a demon called Ajitsukitata Hikone, who takes the form of man and who, and who can control the forces of destruction. There seems to be some sort of secret to the fake gate. Alright, and we are going to need a bit of lightning power if we are to uh, make our way through that gate.
Hmm. Gate over there. Looks pretty important, but we can't get there without a... Well, I don't know how we're supposed to get over there. I don't want to risk hitting that uh, that green thing with a, uh, a shuriken, because that might be related to this uh, Eye of Divine Reckoning here. So... I'd like to make my way around if I can. Also, that is a, uh, that's a Holy Grail tablet up there. I want that. Oops. Well, it turns out I'm dead anyway, so what does it matter? <laughs> I think this is a good place to stop, though. Uh, we finally made it. We finally made a bit of progress. We uh, proved that there's something more to the buried fortress than meets the eye, and we actually saved the final fairy. Very nice, or should I say, very nice? Yeah, <laughs> very godparents. <laughs>